Hey everyone, this is Philip, and this is the best of the week for the Everyday Fighter podcast. You know, I have training partners that kind of do the exact same thing with me. Right. I mean, they're not a heavy bag. I mean, they're absolutely human and all, but they, they push me. They make me better. Um, they, you know, they're, they're a team member to, to me in that, you know, as much punishment as I'm dishing out to them, they're not quitting. You know, and that's one of the things that, that I think, particularly in, in, in a martial arts environment, when, when you have, um, when you have sparring and 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 you're you're working one on one with each other in a way that you're you're challenging each other, it makes it easy for you to kind of form those bonds, to uh, to develop that respect, that affection for each other, because you know that you're there trying to help each other get better. And you know, as I thought more about that over the you know over time. One of the things that uh, came to mind was this saying, this idea that I have, um, and you can go to the Everyday Fighter website uh, to see it if you haven't already, um, everydayfighter.me, but it's, uh, the concept is love your opponent. And, you know, kind of as I extend that idea from the heavy bag to just my sparring slash training partners, I mean, that's something I can extend to somebody in, um, any context really that they are they're helping me they're helping me to get better right in their own way um anybody that's standing in front of me is somebody that is giving me an opportunity to improve myself so my concept of uh love your opponent it goes as follows and i'm just going to read it here off the website so love your opponent for revealing your strengths, for exposing your flaws, for helping you discover what's truly important, what you're made of, who you really are, for taking everything you throw, then asking for more, for standing in front of you, whether solid or unsteady, and asking you to do the same. At that time, things have gotten so bad in my life. I, um, I, I, I got involved in cocaine. And uh, cocaine progressed into methamphetamines. And, you know, I had this facade lifestyle that everything was cool and I'm, I'm a cool guy. And then, you know, I got married I, I, three years into marriage and, you know, I had my wife fooled for a little while. But she came to that point where she was she was tired. Um, she was done. She wanted a divorce. Um, we were separated for about six months and. Um, things were really bad to where, um, in that lifestyle, that, that drug, uh, lifestyle, you know, I, I made some very bad decisions. I had people wanting, uh, to kill me, uh, because, you know, just burning people and just, just my bad behavior. And, um, you know, one day I came home and my wife's, you know, she was done. She said, I, I want a divorce. You know, we were separated six months, but she said, I had it, you know, I, I don't want to be married to a junkie. And my son was three years old at that time. And she was holding him in, in her arms. And, you know, three-year-olds repeat um, what they hear. And, and wow. he said, yeah, you're a junkie. And that, that, that broke my heart, you know, at, at, uh, um, because it was true. Um, it was true. I, I, I was, un, I was out of control and, um, I really believe if, if my life didn't change within the next two uh, weeks, I would, I would have perished. I would have died. Uh. That is what you are able to do. Those three things. One is that you can kind of just grind and do the best that you can with what is presented to you, which is always an option, right? The second is that you can adjust your target, adjust what is presented to you, what's in front of you, 
so that it becomes, if not ideal for you, at least giving you a, a better and improved situation, right? Is that you, you move that target. The third is that you adjust yourself, right? If for some reason the target is, is not moving, your opponent is not moving, then what can you do to put yourself in a, in a better situation? 